AK the Workman's Pomp, back at it again with another Suavecito follow-up. Today I'm going to be talking about the Suavecito OG Conditioner and the Suavecito OG Shampoo. Um, I think these are about halfway full, so I've been using them for a while, so I have a good idea of what they're about. They're the Suavecitos take on traditional, at least I think is what they say on the back, everyday shampoo or like when you need it, obviously, but your kind of go-to mainstay shampoo. Both of them are 16 fluid ounces. The OG shampoo says that it gently cleans, cleanses hair and scalp with hydrating and soothing aloe, the original Suavecito scent. And then this one says it smooths and hydrates hair with the nourishing avocado and coconut oils, original Suavecito scent. So, what is there to say about these? Um, I mean, on the back it says, put it in wet hair, massage to a lather uh, throughout the scalp. Once Rinse thoroughly and repeat if needed. For best results, follow up with the shampoo and this one, or with the conditioner. And this one essentially says, um, put the conditioning in and for a deep condition, leave in three to five minutes. So pretty standard. So what makes the shampoo special? Well, honestly, Nothing, really. They're both pretty standard shampoos. Uh, the only thing that changes, that makes them pretty much different, are the both pretty standard shampoo and conditioner. But what makes them different is that the fact that the scent you get is the OG Suavecito scent. So, to me, the quality of the shampoo you're getting is something that you would get from, um, I would say it's something like to the level of something you get at like Walmart. Um, I think the price on these, I can't remember. I want to say I spent like 20 for both of them, maybe a little bit more. Uh, but to me, I would say that like the price on these, at least the quality that you get is pretty standard. Think of the type of quality you get from their gel type, you know, it's their gel type I've always considered to be not necessarily bad, but not like game changing. The best thing about it was the scent, right? Uh, I know a lot of Suavecito loyalists are gonna say, no, no, there's a lot of good things about it. But Suavecito is essentially just a gel type that has a culture around it, um, you know, based towards the Latinx community, like I've said, which I am a part of probably why I've drawn to it, the col and the cologne scent. Those are the two things that you can get from the, uh, the Suavecito uh, brand. It's the branding and the scent. Those are the two most iconic things. Uh, changed my mind, honestly. Uh, and that's what you get from this. You get the Suavecito scent, which is, like I've said, debatably one of the best scents on the pomade market. It's like a cool water cologne, but like there's something about it that's so refreshing and nice. Um, so what you get here is, um, and when you look at the back, you can see all of the ingredients. This is the ingredients. So, I mean, there are, there is good stuff in there. There's also standard shampoo stuff. Same with the conditioner as well. Uh, I'm not going to go through all of them because there's a lot of big words that I'm not going to be able to pronounce, uh, to be honest with you. So the basic gist of Suavecito, if you're asking yourself, should I get the Suavecito shampoo and conditioner? Like, is it that much better? No. But if you're a fan of the scent, then you're going to like it. Uh, I used it the other night. My hair is pretty, um, you can tell it's like, I mean, my hair always looks shiny, but it's nice and matte looking. Uh, I don't use a lot on there, so you don't need a lot. That's another good thing for the prices. You don't need a lot, like two pumps from this is good, two pumps from that or one, depending. Uh, it's fine. So, um, you know, what what makes it special? Like I said, nothing really other than the scent. You're, you're paying for the scent and you're paying for the, uh, the branding. And honestly, in this instance, just being real with you, shampoo that smells like the Suavecito scent, it's worth it in some cases. Is it gonna get the job done? Sure, it's just like all their other products. It'll get the job done. Um, is it going to excel at the job? No, but it's going to get it done and it's going to do it fine, just fine. Um, so for these, I'm going to give 
because I paired them together, I'm going to give these a uh, 3.8 out of 5. I think these are good. I think they're perfectly fine. For me, shampoo now is a little bit more important. So, you know, I need something with some better ingredients and that are going to be uh, more geared towards my hair type. But if you're looking for just a generic shampoo that will get the job done, that's going to make your hair smell awesome, look no further than the OG conditioner and the OG shampoo. So let me know if you guys have tried this. Let me know what you think and uh, have a good one, guys.